you said you've been single uh, <laughs> well, long, yeah. longest relationship um the situation ship that you're that one, we, currently we, in like yeah so but you're we've technically been, single we've been together for like four years wow Five, almost, but you're yeah. technically single, but you've been together for four mm. years. But it's you're a situation ship. Is it on again, <laughs> off again? Yes. Yeah. Okay. I would call it that for sure. So how long have you been technically single? A few months, like since like. When's the last time you saw the guy? Uh, like two days ago. <laughs> but you've been technic. You saw him two days ago, but you've technically single for a few months. Yeah. <laughs> what makes you technically single? Um, he doesn't want to be my boyfriend. I don't want to be his girlfriend. Are you guys <laughs> seeing other people? It's like a, no, it's that. Single. Yeah. So it's like exclusive. What's the point of putting a, a shit at the end of it if it's not? I, you don't want to see, be together at all. Well, I think it's the title. He he like doesn't want the title. So it's like a relationship without. But what's a title. the point of there being any title at all? That's what I don't get about I, situation. Ship. Yeah. I well, I don't really. Then they used to call it like, like situation ship. But you're also so inclusive. Not exclusively seeing other people. Yeah. Right. Like we are. But if you could, you if you wanted to, you could. Yeah. So I feel like, like like he has encouraged me. As soon to as date, something to better comes along for you or for him, it's it's done. <laughs> I hate to think yes, but like maybe. <laughs> okay. I don't know. <laughs> At least you guys are honest. Are you afraid? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> are you afraid of being heartbroken or what's the reason, uh, if I can ask? No, I'm a, like, I don't know. I'm a tough girl. So what do you I, mean I don't, by I don't, tough girl? What do you like, mean? I don't know that I've ever been heartbroken. Like, oh, sad for sad. sure. Oh. Like, this is like my, like, <laughs> <laughs> no, I bounce back like that. Like, <laughs> no, but like, him. Very <laughs> sad at the thought of losing him. Like this is like my best friend, so it's mm -hmm. like yeah. hard to say goodbye for mm -hmm. sure. So we'll like break up and then just so like still keep hanging out. Thing? Mm, like perhaps, yeah. So yeah. you so you don't want to be with him. He's like your best friend. You bounce back. I like okay, that. like I would if he wanted to be my boyfriend, I would be his girlfriend. <laughs> but <laughs> oh, I so, guess but he doesn't want it. I well. <laughs> That sounds like I don't want to. I was going to say like a situation like, ship if I've ever Exactly. Heard that. Exactly. There's just there's a no lot of complex way to explain feelings going on so here. So much. Yeah. We're all going to have questions. <laughs> I hear you. Are you dating other other people? <laughs> no, I'm not. So, but you've been in this situation ship for 4 years? We like or? no, we were full on together for like I think this is our second break. This is our second breakup. Like oh, we there was broke a break up. up. Who broke up with who? It was mutual. It okay, was mutual. so we got together when I was in college. He moved out to LA um, during COVID, and we were like, okay, like we'll end it here. Um, and then I just kept flying out to see him, and he would come see me in in the city. So it he just would, never would ended. Would he fly out to see you? Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. He would. So I'd see him like every other month, and then we eventually kind of got back together. Like there literally would be a point where I'd be like, so am I your girlfriend yet? Are you my boyfriend? He'd be like. No, and then one day he was just like, "Yeah, he has and then, commitment mm -hmm. issues." <laughs> I'm <Is> sorry. <laughs> don't be. <laughs> don't be committed. I think he maybe, yeah. I think maybe he's I just know. doing some e extracurricular behavior on the side. Yeah, that's yeah. what I'm saying with this cake so and Ignorance too. is bliss yeah. in in my eyes. So yeah. at least well, he's not, not lying. Know. I'd rather not know, honestly. Mm -hmm. like, During the time that ask, you've dated tell. him, have you seen any other guys? Um, during our first Break. breakup, yeah, I did. Okay. And he, like, told me he was seeing people out here, too. I was back in right. Chicago, so. Um, Chi-town. Yeah, well, I was still living in my college town, actually, but yeah, yeah. So <laughs> he was seeing other people. I was kind of, like, not really seeing other people, but. Okay. Do you think it would hurt you if he found out he was seeing other people now? Depends on in what context. Like, sleeping with other people, no, doesn't really bother me. But if he were like full on dating another girl, yeah, I'd be sad. <laughs> we got the technically single for, for four years, but the, you know, did you have any things that came to mind? Uh, sure, sure. I've, I've got a few questions all around. Um, technically single, I mean, that was the one where you said that you would date him if he wanted to, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so that's, I mean, we have kind of like a designation for that. We I mean, I have, like, I have, uh, uh, I don't so know scared. if you guys are familiar with my work. I, I make these <coughs> silly little drawings. Uh, Nick, do you want to get full screen for a second? I think, I think that you're just sort of landing in this area right here. Like, you would be the keeper if you could be, but he oh, doesn't want you to be. Would you say that that's right? Yeah, yeah, I would. So <laughs> why do you do that to yourself? 
you know, the chances of him changing his mind are really, really low. Nick, I'd... Well, I mean, I'm like, I'm very independent. So like, I live on my own. I'm happy to be mm. on my own. So the fact that I enjoy my time with him and he is like my best friend, I feel like I'm just enjoying the time that I do have with him in whatever okay. context, whatever capacity. Um, uh -huh. So I like, I would like to be a mother someday, not necessarily mm -hmm. a wife. Like that's not even, I don't ever need to get married. I just want kids and a house sure. to take care of. I want to be a little, Oof, that's like, a, red a housewife, it's, but. It's <laughs> the future, it's what we're but, doing now. I understand that. And well, he's like, he might be that, you, you know? You had a kind of a reaction to what she said. What, what specifically did she say that you, well, it's a, it's a gigantic well, red flag when somebody says that they want to be a mother but not a wife because it means that you're looking for a guy to give you his seed and then if you don't want to be his wife, then he's on the hook for child support and he's basically not going to be able to see his kid. You're going to take his money. Like, that's that's <laughs> no, what comes okay. to our head when that, we do that. So. I should have... It's not that I don't want to be a wife. It's like my whole life I've pictured being a mother, a caretaker, like a housewife, but I just... Marriage in itself, like... So you sharing want a, taxes so and all that I don't need to do all that to like a long term partner that lives with me you want a man to give I, you I, I want a partner you want a man to give you a child but you yeah. don't want to be a wife I I would be a wife I'd be okay, a so really you, good wife okay. yeah 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 but like it's just, it's just not necessary exactly so as in the children the, are necessary the legal, the legal side not. of things isn't necessary right. oh, correct okay. oh, I that's agree exactly with that. yeah the government getting involved I agree with that interesting interesting Jay did you have a response to that yeah, I or, mean, how does that math, fit sorry. into your overall life plan? Is uh, One thing I do is I do kind of life coaching, and I just mm -hmm. check on where people are going overall. And I think that's something a lot of people are doing is thinking just like about right now what they're doing and what feels good. And, you know, this is something that women have done with me over and over again is they kind of throw themselves into my life and they go, I'm enjoying it right now. And I go, well, it's never going to go beyond that. And they sort of wait to see if it does or if someone else wants to do something with them and especially if the other guys see that she's hanging out with me they're less inclined to do that and it's kind of like i feel like you're sabotaging yourself perhaps <laughs> um i i don't know my parents got married had kids really young so they always encouraged me to just wait and enjoy my youth and travel and you know enjoy life on my own so i'm like more than happy to do that right now. I don't necessarily yeah. have a life plan. <laughs> like I. <laughs> oh, hold on, just Grid a second. Grid One Motorsports donated ninety-nine dollars. Fear is the spare change that will keep you broke. Much like continuing to chase after a man that uses you for sex and just has to be your best friend in return. I like that word. Word. Uh, yo, Grid One, good to see you in the chat, man. Thank you very much. That was poetic, dude. Thank you. That that was yeah. beautiful. Can you send one like as a haiku, please? Because I'm trying to. <laughs> um, go ahead. I think you were finishing a thought. Oh gosh, I, I think a, I was finishing. I have a, a question thought. for you. Yeah. Do you feel like is there any part of you that feels like you don't deserve what you want, like you don't deserve to be a wife and a mother and have all those things? To tap into childhood trauma, yeah, for sure. <laughs> like, yeah, I definitely. Yeah, I feel like. Yeah, I just yeah, yeah. Do you think um, the OF is? <laughs> <laughs> Do you think the OF might be putting like a strain on your relationship? No, no. Like that is like sex is like the start of our like a base of our a pillar of our relationship. So wait, that's like, but that's not healthy. <laughs> <laughs> well, wait, you're so you're you're, the, your OnlyFans is the. Pillar no, not my only fans. No, the sex I have with this man, like oh, that's, that that's the pillar. A pillar. A oh, pillar. one of the pillars. Yes. Like that's just. What we, about the fact that other people get to see it? Do you think that that's a, an issue? Do you think issue? that he might be really enjoying the sex, but then when it comes to the long-term point of view, that might be a disqualifier? No, he. I mean, like he participates in the only fans so what, what would what would he manages get out the of it, what would he get out of making it exclusive? Like, what extra benefit would he get? I, I don't know. I'm giving him all the benefits already. So yeah. I like I I. Uh, while I don't agree with his mindset, I totally understand it. Yeah. Like you know, I would love to be the wife and do all the things, but like, I understand that he. If he told you to delete it tomorrow, and you just he, mean he's he you're giving him all of those wife things like, without being yeah the ti without just having the title. What about if he, if he partner, told you to delete yeah. it tomorrow and he said that we can be together? You just got to delete your OnlyFans. Would you do it? 
Yeah. Okay. As long as he's paying the bills, you know, because that's paying the bills now. Does he get money from your OF? No. But you said if he we, manages if we reach it. A, right. right. If we reach a certain profit, then he would, but oh. we're not there. But you said so he, I get to keep He's it not just in the videos. He's also helping you manage it, too. Right. That's a new thing. We're oh. officially business partners. <laughs> but he's not getting paid yet? Or? No. Oh, it's he doesn't want the money. He wants me to have all the money. Currently. So he's not a business partner. He's a helper. Yeah, I suppose. <laughs> then what's all that you give to him? What's that all that you give star. to him? Would you, what, what's that what you give to him? Except, you know, like having sex what and do I, all these, like, I mean, cook, cook for, for him, him, clean his space, mm. do his laundry, all the mm. things that I you enjoy to do. I'm like a, no, we don't. I'm like a total caretaker as a person. Mm. Like, I just, that's the only passion I really have in life is taking care of other people. Mm. So, like, I love this man and I love, like, I get joy out of taking care of him. Uh, 